Welcome to the Nine News Backyard, everybody. There's a reason we are back here. Trees, of course, are very awe-inspiring. I want to pull up a picture for you to check out. This is our director, Moss. He enjoyed meeting some giant redwoods recently. Just look at how small he looks compared to this huge tree. This is just so incredible that this is here in the United States. So beautiful. And you know, the first Arbor Day was actually celebrated back in 1872. It's such a big thing to celebrate when it comes to our trees here in our incredible nation. Now, that being said, we want to share the results of a pretty amazing uh, survey that was taken recently, a new Arbor Day survey. Dan Lamb, author and CEO of the Arbor Day Foundation, will share more about those results. Well, Dan, it's so nice to talk to another Dan this morning, talking about some important things. It's great to see you. How are you? I'm great. Thanks for having me. Of course. Okay, so what does the Arbor Day Foundation do? The Arbor Day Foundation is the world's largest nonprofit organization dedicated to planting trees. And we have been around for 50 years, and in those first 50 years, we planted nearly 500 million trees in more than 50 countries around the world. And it's, I'll tell you, it's a pretty great job that there's never been a more important time to be planting trees than today. Wow, I, I couldn't agree more. I mean, we here in Colorado, I think oftentimes take advantage of the trees that we have here. So it's so nice to see so much work being done to make sure that they continue to grow strong and beautifully. Now, can you share more about your recent survey and what it shows about the public's perception of trees? Of course, at the Arbor Day Foundation, we know trees are important, but we wanted to take the temperature of Americans to see how tuned in they were to the importance of trees. So we worked with the Harris Poll to do an independent survey and the results were exciting and validating. People care about trees. The survey said more than 94% of Americans recognize the value and important role trees play for our planet, with another 90% of Americans agreeing that we should be planting more trees in our nation's forests as much as possible today. And all that was exciting, but what was maybe most shocking and newsworthy was that we got more than 90% of Americans to agree on anything. And so it was just really a validating that trees are a unifying force. People just kind of get it. They get the yeah. importance of trees. That is so huge. I, I love that you said that because I think if anybody agrees on something is that we need the trees in our world. That's so great. Now, what are some issues that we need to be watching out for and acting up on uh, that you think that we really need to, you know, hone in on these days? Well, one of the other findings from the survey was that 90% of Americans feel like trees are one of the most important tools we have to battle our changing climate, which is just another great reminder of why we celebrate Arbor Day and why we need to be planting more trees. Yes, that is so huge. Dan, in your opinion, what's the best way to celebrate trees every day? Of course, we want to celebrate Arbor Day, but every day I think we should be taking advantage of the incredible trees we have right here in our own backyard. No, I could not agree with you more, of course. And fortunately, people celebrate Arbor Day in all kinds of different ways throughout the year, just planting trees, volunteering in their community. This year, the Arbor Day Foundation wants to make it as easy as possible for everybody to engage and make impact. So we've created a hashtag Arbor Day campaign. Anyone who uses hashtag Arbor Day this week on any of their social media channels, the Arbor Day Foundation will plant a tree in their honor in one of our nation's forests. Wow. Well, Dan, how can people learn more about the Arbor Day Foundation and, you know, get involved? Anyone who wants to learn more about the Arbor Day Foundation or how to plant trees, where to plant, what to plant, can go to our website at arborday.org, arborday.org. And don't forget, anyone who wants to plant a tree can use our hashtag Arbor Day campaign. Post hashtag Arbor Day on any of your social media channels this week, and we'll plant a tree in one of our nation's forests in your honor. What a great excuse to get outside and really enjoy nature and everything we have around us. Well, Dan, before we let you go this morning, uh, I wanted to ask you, do you have a favorite forest, favorite group of trees you can tell us about? It's tough for me to pick favorites as chief executive of the Arbor Day Foundation. I've had the chance to visit a lot of forests, but there's no doubt one of the most amazing spaces in the United States for sure is out in California, Northern California, amongst the beautiful, majestic redwoods that just tower over you and you just know they've been there for centuries and they just kind of keep you in perspective. And uh, again, I've been to a lot of forest landscapes around the world um, and it's just a, it's any chance I get to be in those kind of forest space, it's a special time.
Yes, putting it on my bucket list. Thanks, Dan. Thank you. You can learn more about the Arbor Day Foundation survey and get ideas on how to plant and preserve trees. Just go to arborday.foundation.org and don't forget post about the trees this week using the hashtag Arbor Day. For every post you make, the Arbor Day Foundation plants a tree.